the St James's place fox hunters chase is next this is also referred to as the amateurs gold cup in so7 land it's for the lower stables normally rated just 0 to 110 over exactly the same course and distance as the previous race the Cheltenham Gold Cup on at the top we got Wisdom for Alex Cherry Barbican Grove Stu Gray Boomerang Aman Graham Clutterbuck Finding Alice Martin Leedham Timeline Vale Graham Clutterbuck Cirque Martin Leedham Glen Fire Fredlot for Alex Cherry Thistledown Davinda Padre Hogan Mr Wiseman Stu Gray Rose of Darkness Padre Hogan and Misty Rain for Obi Wan so 11 in this then as opposed to the 21 we've just had in the Gold Cup. I'm got a feeling they might go just a little bit quicker in this race than they did in what was the strangest Gold Cup I've seen in my time in the SO world because they didn't go any pace at all. And there must have been eight or ten of them in with a chance to jump in the last. So away we go. Let's hope this race is as thrilling but maybe a little quicker. And Wisdom on the outside is just about the first to show. Quite a few trainers double-handed in this. And... Wisdom and Glen Five Fredlock, the two for Alex Cherry. Currently share the lead. Pulling for its head the first of Graham Clutterbox two. That's over in third place. That was um, I've got the two of them mixed up there for a minute. <laughs> Boomerang and Man is the other one as they make their way to the second. And Wisdom is the leader from Misty Rain in second, Rose of Darkness. He's in third, and comes Timeline Vale in fourth, and Barbican Grove, and then Boomerang Amar and Glen Fire Fredlot, with Thistle Down Davinda, just the back marker at this stage then, so they've sort of sorted themselves out, and Wisdom and Misty Rain have gone on there, setting a slightly stiffer pace than the one we had in the previous race, and Wisdom is going to lead into the next. They're all safely over that one, and making their way towards the water jump with Wisdom in front, Misty Rain second, and the Stu Grey pair. Barbican Grove and Mr. Wiseman with Timeline Vale the Grey in between them as they get over the water jump. And the second of the Greys is Finding Alice on the inside. Stable companion to that one, Cirque in the middle of the field. Two Padraig Hogan horses. Rose of Darkness, the one closest to us. And Thistle Down Davinda towards the back as they get over that ditch. Boomerang Aman has just dropped to the back. So Wisdom's been given a clear lead. And he gets into this next one. With Misty Rain over it in second. All jumping okay at this point. Stu Gray third and fourth. Stu Gray won this race last season. We're hoping to do so again. Get off the mark for the festival. And it's Wisdom in the lead. From Misty Rain in second. Barbican Grove and Mr. Wiseman. In Glen Fire Fredlock after that one as they take the seventh. Which they're all safely over. And Wisdom is in the lead. Next was from a downhill. Bit of a mistake towards the back there by Rose of Darkness. Who's the back marker? Rose of Darkness, a bit of a upset horse in this, but it technically shouldn't be running. And the distance rules has only been running over two and a half miles and is therefore ineligible for this race as it's a handicap over three and a quarter miles, but has somehow managed to sneak in. As they get over that one, these things, little glitches can happen now and again. I don't know if there's any great harm done, but it's wisdom in the lead. Mind you, I might not be saying that if it wins and mine comes second, but we'll see. Anyway, Wisdom's in front as they get over the 10th. And they're all safely over the 10th with Wisdom in the lead. Misty Rain second, Barbican Grove is third, then Cirque is fourth. Then comes Timeline Vale and Glen Fire Fredlock, and then Mr. Wiseman. And then comes Boomerang Aman, Thistle Down to Vinda, Finding Alice, and finally Rose of Darkness currently at the back. Wisdom bowling along in the lead, only leads by two now. So they make their way towards the next fence. Wisdom lands in front from Misty Rain. Barbican Grove was a little bit untidy and has lost a place or two. Cirque and Timeline Vale just gone past him. And on the outside is a second Alex Cherry horse, Glenfire Fredlock. Good jump there by Thistle Down the Vinder. Seeing that one go alongside Mr. Wiseman into a share of about sixth. Finding Alice just drops towards the back. The race uphill and then now onto the back part of the track. They come to a plain fence shortly and then onto the water. And Wisdom is joined by Misty Rain. Misty Rain in the yellow. Wisdom in the blue, white and orange. As they get over the next, they landed together. Over in third was 
timeline, Val Cirk was there in fourth. Then Thistle down to Vinder and Barbican Grover and Glen Fry Fredlock. Then comes Finding Alice getting a bit closer. Mr. Wiseman on the rail. Rose of Darkness creeping into it as well as they get over the water. And Boomerang Aman is now the back marker. They're racing towards the next fence. With Wisdom and Misty Rain over this ditch. And Finding Alice has jumped right through into third there. Timeline Vale in fourth, then Cirque, and then Mr. Wiseman thistled down to Vinder and Barbican Grove. Rows of darkness as they get over the next. All safely over that one as well. Glen Five Fredlock has just dropped to the back. Thistle down to Vinder was untidy. And Misty Rain has now got the lead by neck. It's Misty Rain in front from Mr. Wiseman who's come through on in third as well. Then finding Alice and Rose of Darkness as they get over this ditch. Rose of Darkness really attacked that fence well and has now come through to challenge for the lead. And it's Wisdom and Misty Rain still. Rose of Darkness, Mr. Wiseman, Finding Alice, Cirque. That's the leading group. They're being chased by Boomerang Amar and Timeline Vale. And there's nothing really out of this yet as they race downhill and swing left-handed towards the next end. This is the 19th corrupt. This is the fourth from home. And it's Wisdom who's kicked on again in the lead. Wisdom takes it in front. They all stream over it nicely. Then it's Wisdom, Boomerang Aman and Rose of Darkness. These three being chased by Finding Alice, Misty Rain. Then come Barbican Grove, Mr. Wiseman and Cirque as they race down towards the third last. Boomerang Aman has gone for home now, surely. Boomerang Aman's gone two to three, clear, jumping over the third last. Good jump by Rose of Darkness in second. And then Finding Alice moves into third. Timeline Veil is in fourth. But it's Boomerang Aman who's made the first run for home then. Racing down towards the final two fences in the St. James's Place. Place Fox on to chase and it's Boomerang Aman who's well clear. Jockey looks pretty confident. Had a little look round. Finding Alice is in hot pursuit in second. Then comes Rose of Darkness and Timeline Veil. Vale. But it's Boomerang Aman who looks like he might well take this unless he falls over. He's got two more fences to take but Finding Alice is getting closer. It's Boomerang Aman in the lead. Over to second last. Boomerang Aman landed nicely in front. Rose Nice is trying to close. Glen Fry Fredlock went at the back. They're racing down towards the final fence in there. And Boomerang Aman is still three lengths clear of Finding Alice over the final fence they go and it's Boomerang Aman finding Alice is trying to close racing up the hill it's Boomerang Aman who's holding on finding Alice has not got the speed to take it and it's going to be Boomerang Aman that wins this and James's place Fox on to Boomerang Aman wins it finding Alice is second Rose of Darkness third time on Vale was fourth then came Mr. Wiseman and Barbican Grove and Cirque and all the way back to Wisdom and Boomerang Aman takes it Graham Clutterbuck's third winner of the week. Wins it nicely. Good four lengths clear of finding Alice. Back in second, Rose of Darkness was third. So Boomerang Amar takes it for Graham Clutterbuck. Finding Alice second for Martin Lidham. Rose of Darkness for Padre Hogan was third. Timeline Vale for Graham Clutterbuck was fourth. And Mr. Wiseman for Stu Gray was fifth.